All right, so the phrasal verb turn out means a surprise ending, okay? And uh, so it's when you want to talk about the result and you weren't expecting it. So let's imagine that you go to the store and you buy a computer. Uh, now, I was thinking, I know that you're going to the store to buy a computer. I was thinking, oh, it's probably going to be very expensive. Maybe you also thought it's probably going to be very expensive. But when you arrive at the store, there's a giant sale. So it wasn't expensive. This is your surprise result, your surprise ending. Later, if I say, oh, how was the computer? Was it expensive? You say, no, I was very surprised. It was cheap. Or you can say, it turned out to be cheap. It turned out to be cheap. That means, surprise, it was cheap. It wasn't expensive like we thought. Okay, uh, let's try another example. Maybe this new computer we think is going to be super fast, but surprise, it's very slow. How can you tell me that, oh, I'm very surprised, it's slow, it's not fast like I thought? It turned out to be slow. It turned out to be slow. Okay, uh, let's try one more. Uh, imagine that you're very excited to go see a movie. And uh, this movie is one that you thought would be very interesting. So, oh wow, I'm going to see the movie. It's going to be interesting. No, surprise, it was boring. Okay, so how can you tell me Oh, surprise, uh, I thought it was going to be boring, or interesting, but it's, it, it was boring. It turned out to be boring. How can you tell me, or what's the difference between saying it was boring and it turned out to be boring? What's the difference between those two things? It was boring and it turned out to be boring. If you say it turned out to be boring, that means I thought it was going to be good but it wasn't, it was boring. So it adds this little extra dimension of, I'm surprised by this, it wasn't what I thought.